Hello, this is Matthew Mead and this is an overview of the new features contained within the 6.5 release of Axis Camera Station Pro. In this release we have made major improvements to the Axis Control management functionality. The card holder management pane has a new look and feel. Card holder images are displayed for quick identification of card holders and there are two new columns highlighting both the status of the card holder, such as suspended, and if the card holder information is imported from Active Directory. The group column displays which groups your card holder belongs to, and you can easily view, edit, and add to your groups. The search functionality searches all of the fields within the cardholder information. This can be really useful, for example, if a car has left their lights on in the car park, I can search a specific vehicle registration plate and find the owner. Access rules within the system are clearly displayed with an overview of their associations, and you can click on them to see exactly what cardholders, doors and schedules are applied to them. A new addition is the ability to create incomplete action rules. Here you can see the rear door action rule does not currently have a door associated with the rule. This can be really useful if the installation is not complete. A rule can be created with the card holders and the schedules and when the door is finally installed, you can add it to the action rule and it will be operational. Reports have been improved and in addition to the system configuration reports, roll call reports can now be generated. Operators can create their own reports containing the zones, groups, mustering points and timeframes of their choice. Multiple reports can be saved for easy access. Finally, within Access Management, we have two email templates for use when emailing QR and mobile credentials. Another improvement has been made within Data Search. When data search is used in conjunction with vehicle data, you can select filters that are tailored for this data. Here, you can see multiple options related to vehicle data. The filter enables the search of multiple inputs such as part of a license plate and vehicle color. The results returned here are only for white vehicles containing a zero in the license plate. Finally, if you're utilizing cloud services with your solution, you will now be able to use Smart Search when using the My Systems portal. As with the Windows client, you will be able to select cameras, apply additional filters, and search for object characteristics such as person or vehicle. Here, I've selected bus and the results have been returned within my internet browser. I hope you have found this video of interest. Thank you for watching.